Hello everyone, I'm Jadan Kastanovsky. I'm associate professor at University of Zadar in Croatia. And uh, I'm very active in building infrastructures, uh, uh, supporting open research in Croatia. And that's the, my main role for the last few decades. Uh, so the roles and responsibilities of peer reviewers will likely evolve in response to increasing focus on open data and uh, research practices. The approach to the authors doesn't matter if we speak about underlying or, or raw, but open research data can be twofold. The first is related to the regular normal reviewers who will uh, collaborate more closely with editors to ensure that manuscripts adhere to the journal's open data policies. Additionally, reviewers, regular reviewers, will check the completeness and accuracy of manuscript data availability statements and where data can be assessed. Data accessibility is not only including data sets, but also code and supplementary materials. Furthermore, reviewers will be more focused on assessing whether the study, study's methods and findings are reproducible and replicable by other researchers. Again, they may examine the availability of code, software and detailed procedures to facilitate replication. The second approach would include a new type of peer reviewers. I will call them data reviewers, specializing in research data stewardship. Such reviewers will uh, evaluate the data quality primarily and methods used in the study, including assessing whether the data are well documented and conform to open data standards. Furthermore, they can assess whether authors have transparently reported their data sources, collection processes, and data cleaning procedures. They may also consider whether the study adheres to relevant reporting guidelines for open research. Data reviewers, specialists in statistics, which we have already for a long time will continue to evaluate appropriateness of statistical analysis and assess whether the statistical methods are valid for the research questions. They may also check for potential errors in statistical reporting. Data reviewers may also evaluate the ethical aspects of data sharing, including issues related to informed consent, data privacy, and sensitive information. Data reviewers may also play a role in educating authors about open data benefits and best practices. They may provide constructive feedback and guidance on improving data sharing and openness. So both type of reviewers may encourage proper citation and attribution of data sets and other research outputs promoting the culture of giving credit to data providers and supporting data creators. There is a growing emphasis on ensuring research validity, accuracy and reproducibility in response to concerns surrounding fake or fraudulent research. Peer review will evolve to place greater scrutiny on the data, methodology, and reproducibility of research findings. As I already mentioned, peer reviewers will be increasingly tasked with assessing the quality and integrity of the data presented in the manuscript, which includes verifying the authenticity of data sources, checking for data manipulation or fabrication, and ensuring the data collection and handling follow ethical and scientific standards. In order to ensure research validity, reviewers will be expect, expected to evaluate the rigor and appropriateness of the research methodology. They assess whether the methods are well designed, statistically sound, 
and capable of producing reliable results. Changes that have already started result from a greater emphasis on transparency in reporting methods and results. Authors are encouraged to provide detailed description of their methods, including any software code or instruments used. Reviewers assess whether these descriptions are clear and comprehensive to facilitate reproducibility. Both editors and reviewers play a role in assessing the ethical aspects of research, including authorship, attribution, data sharing, conflict of interest, and adherence to ethical guidelines and regulations. Editors are often equipped with the tools to detect plagiarism and unoriginal content. They check whether the manuscript contains any instances of plagiarism or self-plagiarism. Also, in addition to pre-publication peer review, post-publication review is gaining attention as a way to scrutinize further published research for accuracy, validity, and reproducibility. To conclude, the evolving focus of peer review is aligned with the broader scientific community's commitment to improving the quality and reliability of research, ensuring the validity and reproducibility of research findings is essential to maintaining the integrity of scientific literature and addressing concerns related to fraudulent or fake research. To successfully fulfill this transition towards more reproducible and reliable research practices, peer review training should be provided to peer reviewers to enhance their skills in evaluating data, methodology, and reproducibility, and encourage them to stay informed about best practices in research assessment. Also, it is important to adapt open research practices, which include making data, code, and study materials openly available.